So if you want to be inspired to be a powered up mum, keep watching. So hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I hope you're doing really well. So this video is gonna be a very requested video actually. It's my morning, I'm gonna do my morning to afternoon routine. Um, this is requested a lot and I feel I haven't done one of these for quite a while. So it is a weekday today, it is Thursday. Um, I was up super, super early. Um, I'm an early bird anyway, as you all know, but today earlier than normal, um, simply because I needed to wash my hair. I did. Today is, today is Thursday and I haven't washed my hair since Saturday. Mm, yeah, it desperately needed a wash and it feels so much better. Um, so I got up super early, I had a bath, had a bit of a pamper, I waved my hair, put some makeup on. So I do all that and that is an integral part of my morning. Um, not every morning, um, a lot of mornings I do have a shower and I will be makeup free. Um, but today I thought I'm gonna make the effort. So you would have seen me do all the standard morning stuff. Atticus's pat lunch is done. He's downstairs having his breakfast. Um, there's always some washing up in the morning. Um, I done that, I have put a wash on. I do my washing every two days. So today um, it's a washing day. They are all the standard things um, that I will do before the school run. Once Atticus has finished his breakfast, I'll go downstairs, I'll clear the breakfast stuff up, and then it will be time for him to get ready. All his uniform is laid out. I always lay that out the night before. Now, first of all, I wanna give a great big thanks to GP Batteries for sponsoring my morning to afternoon routine. You would have actually seen me, one of the reasons why I'm such a powered up mum, um, you would have seen me charging my batteries with my GP recharge. Wow, game changer. I'm gonna be showing you throughout my morning to afternoon routine how um, the GP um, recharge helps me to um, power up my devices, my things which use so many batteries, which are a complete bugbear for me, but the GP recharge has solved that problem. Basically, I never need to buy packs of batteries again. GP batteries have been leading battery experts for over 50 years. They're one of the biggest suppliers of portable power. When GP batteries got in touch with me and asked if I'd like to try the rechargeable battery bundle, I was like, yes please. I'm one of their mums, <clears throat> as I'm sure it's not just mums, mums, dads, people in general, batteries for pretty much a lot of stuff around the house. Um, for one, Atticus's toys, um, constantly needing batteries. Um, the TV remote seems to run out of batteries very, very quickly. And I also have, um, which you would have seen before, like battery powered candles, which I use a lot. So that's a lot of batteries. And I find I'm constantly buying batteries. Um, batteries, they're not the cheapest thing. I mean, yeah, you can get the cheap ones, um, but they don't last long, um, let's face it. So they're not the cheapest things. And this, this is gonna save you pennies. This is gonna be so budget friendly. Each battery can be charged up to 200 times. Yes. So you imagine how much it would cost you to buy 200 single use batteries. Yeah, exactly. In each box, like this comes um you'll get the charger 
like so, which you would have seen earlier. Very simple plug-in. Um, the LED lights, if the lights are flashing, then that means your batteries are charging. Um, when the lights are solid, each battery is fully charged. So these will recharge your batteries in three to six hours. So as you would have seen, I charged um, these up a lot earlier and they are ready to go. Great thing as well, it will also detect bad or um, dead batteries. If the LED light is um, flashing rapidly, not like slowly when it's charging, but if it's flashing rapidly, then that will tell you that your batteries are dead. It's perfectly safe. It has an auto cut off and heat protection. The thing I'm really happy about, the power cuts off when the batteries are fully charged. It obviously saves energy and also prolongs the battery life. Battery temperature is monitored. Um, so when it um, reaches a safe value, the power will automatically cut off, which is great complete peace of mind and the most important thing as well it is a sustainable source of power so as our lives get busier um it is our responsibility um to use more sustainable sources of power and this is great for that this is going to save me pennies it's going to make my life a lot lot easier because what i plan to do um obviously put batteries in um the things that need batteries and then obviously i will have some charged up ready to go so it'll be no more of atticus Mum, the remote needs batteries. Oh no, haven't got any. Oh no, end of the world. <laughs> no more of that. Can be a powered up mum or dad or just a powered up person in general. Head to JD Sports um, where they have got some special offers on your GP recharge, batteries and charger. It's a complete game changer and it's just going to make your life that bit easier. You know, on for anything that makes life a little bit easier um, and this is it for me. So I'm really, really pleased that um, I've tried this out. So I cannot recommend enough heading to JD Sports where they have got some great offers on these um, and pick up your GP recharge. It's going to save your pennies so cost effective you're going to be using sustainable power and it's going to make your life a lot easier it's a win-win you can see i'm charging up some more just here behind me handy little shelf here to put the charger and charge them up find the link in the description box below where you can find out all about the gp recharge well, let's crack on with my morning routine all right so first wash is done now what i normally do if i have time i will put it on the dryer before um i do the school run it is now atticus is just getting ready it is just gone eight o'clock if i've got time to put the washing on the dryer um before the school run i will do it if not i will do it when i get back home it's about 20 past eight now so this is the time generally um we'll start getting shoes and coats on and um start getting ready to leave Have a flat white, please. A flat white? Yeah. Is it just that one up there? Yeah, thank you. So it's now, it's only five past nine. Um, I've got my coffee. I've got my coffee from Costa today because um, I had a free one on the app, so why not? Um, so my normal thing to do nine times out of ten when i took atticus to school is to come and get a coffee not every morning um again depending on what i'm doing where i'm going but i normally will get a coffee it's my few minutes to like decompress you know after the school mornings um which as a mum can be pretty hectic as i'm sure you mums or dads know um so I sort of tend to sit here for a few minutes um, and have a nice coffee and just, yeah, decompress. Um, so I've got a flat white, which is my pretty much standard um, coffee early in the mornings. What I would normally do, right, so if I'll drop Atticus off at school, then if I need to go to um, a supermarket um, or I need to go to any shops to pick up anything, I will always tend to do that straight after the school run, after I've had a coffee. Um, I like to do it that way, get everything done, then I can just go home and get work, etc. done at home. But today, as it happens, I don't need to go to a shop. 
wow, get me, I don't need to go to a shop. Um, so I'm gonna have my coffee and then I'm gonna head home. Um, when I get home, I'm gonna sort out the washing, which you would have seen. Um, the second wash should have done also. So I'm gonna put all that on the dryer. I'm gonna get some content for Instagram. Um, I'm gonna do my emails, which I tend to do um, after the school run. Yeah, I will show you doing that. So I am gonna finish my coffee and then we will head home. So the light is solid, so batteries are fully charged. So let's get them in um, the remote and my candles. So before Atticus comes home from school, the remote is gonna be ready and I'm gonna put my GP batteries that are fully charged into the remote. Next thing I'm gonna um, put my charged batteries in is these. I have a lot of these um, battery power candles safe but they use a lot of batteries. So this is a game changer for me. Good to know they're a lot more powerful as well. So they're gonna last longer. Oh, I'm gonna charge some more up for the rest of my candles. Um, and then I'm even gonna charge some more so I've got some ready to go. Um, really great bit of kit. It comes obviously with the USB plug. So I'll just connect into um, your normal USB outlet. Yeah, great bit of kit get to JT Sports. I am going to put, it is five past ten, almost ten past ten, I am going to put the first lot of washing on the heated dryer. I am living for them days when the washing can be hung outside. It's coming, it is coming. Um, then the second wash is done, then I will put that on. What I would normally do, by the time I've done that, I'll have a nice cup of tea, do a bit more work on the computer. Um, I don't my Instagram content, um, uploaded that, what I would normally do, probably then it will be time for me to eat um, in the mornings. I can't eat too early. Let's get this washing on the dryer. About five to 11 now, and this is generally between, we'll say between 10 and 11 is sort of when the time I start to eat. So you could call it a very late breakfast or you could call it an early lunch. And I fancy toast. I'm gonna have some toast. Um, I'm gonna have some toast. I think I'm gonna have toast with, I'm feeling Marmite. I think I fancy Marmite today. Um, we've got the, Rustic Luna. It's early afternoon now, and um, what I like to do, and what I've started to like, not every day by any means, but um, to try and carve some very, very quiet, mindful time into my day. Um, it helps me, helps me focus and helps me distress. Um, so I'm gonna do some of that. So basically what I'll do, I'll light a candle and basically, I guess you could call it a bit of meditation um but it's just something and i always like to sit here facing um the park um can see all the nature um so i'm going to sit and i am going to do some of that um so i hope you've enjoyed my 
morning to afternoon routine of a powered up mum is my life. This is me, this is my routine generally every single weekday. Obviously with tweaks here and there depending on what work I have, um, what shopping I need to do. Um, obviously school holidays are different also but this was a typical um, this was a typical midweek morning to afternoon routine. So I am going to relax. I am going to light my candle and relax. Really, really hope you have enjoyed. See you very, very soon for another video. Bye.